can't see me now. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I know I said I wasn't gonna use it yet, but I couldn't wait. I was really excited to use the intro, so rather than wait till tomorrow with our reactions to start using it, I decided to use it to, on today's video. As you guys know, it's Yu-Gi-Oh! Day, and we, I do have something special for you guys, but I do have a little bit of bad news. As you guys know, you probably see it all over YouTube from other yu gi tubers but Phantom Rage has dropped today. I have three boxes that I'm going to open for you guys, but unfortunately, when I attempted to record the uh, the opening, for some reason, my camera stopped like two packs into the third box. So you guys will get to see my first two boxes, and unfortunately, won't get to see what I pulled out of my last box, which kind of sucks. I did pull some good stuff out of my last box. That being said, uh, the only archetypes in this set that I'm really worried about are Phantom Knights, Mutants, and um, Dual Avatars. So anything else that I pulled is up for grabs. You guys can let me know in the comments if you're interested. Or you guys can hit me up on Twitter. Uh, link to my Twitter will be down in the description. DM me. At me. Whatever works. But let's jump into the video. Alright. As you guys can see, I already unwrapped the boxes just to make it easier to get through. Well, let's start it off. If you guys are wondering what I'm aiming for, I'm aiming for the Phantom Knight support, uh, specifically uh, Torn Scale, I think they changed the name to, and uh, this guy. I'm also looking for the Mutant support and the Dual Avatar support. Anything else is technically up for grabs. Arcane Reading, Dual Avatar Compact. I know it's just a common book. Ooh! I actually like that card. All right, not a not a bad first pack. Starting off strong with an ultra. All right. Virtual world. I heard virtual world's pretty good, but I don't actually. Prank kid. Super. I need that. <laughs> Rookie for hire. I need that for a friend of mine. All right, not bad so far. Not bad so far. Like I said, if you guys see anything that, obviously, that I'm not keeping that you guys are interested in, more than welcome to let me know in the comments. Uh, UI. I'm sorry I'm speeding through it. Uh, I actually love the way a lot of these cards look. Another super. It's just, uh, we've got three boxes to go through, and I don't want to make this video super long, and you guys get bored. Next. I'm actually going to throw this on the floor. I'll pick that up later. Raid Raptor Heal Edge. UA Locker Room. I'm not going to try to pronounce that. Yo. All right. <laughs> oh, no. Jack in the Hand. Dual Avatar Return. Cupid 4. That's an interesting name. So far, we're looking pretty good. I mean, we'll see what... What we get for secrets? Hopefully, uh, we get really lucky. Tri braid. I, I know a friend of mine that wants tri brigade. That's the dual avatar spell. I, I actually run two of those in my build of the deck because I play um pure phantom Knights, so that's pretty good. Now I know I've done videos on my channel for both dual avatar before they were called dual avatar. And mutants, and I'm really excited for both of them. I'll put that. I'll put that over here just because uh, I do. I do run one. Cause reasons. Oh, the new Giz Gizmek monster. Nice. Jabbing panda. Infinity. Infinity suppression. That's just. I didn't know they were trying to bring infernities back. Honestly, I don't really take much interest in main sets. I usually just buy signals, but. This one had so many things in it that I wanted, that I was really excited for. I didn't know they reprinted Infernity Doom March Fiend. Wait. I'm thinking of the level, the level 4 normal uh, effect monster. Trying to make sure you guys see this. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Another Mutant Blast. 
Keener reading. Raiders. Ooh. Put that over there. Charge into a dark world. Awakened of the possessed. I wonder if they did that because they put the possessed card because of the. Uh, must have been because of the starter deck. Alright, what else we got? Another mutant blast. Infernity, Infernity, Virtual World. Another dual avatar trap. Alright. Damn, this has been a pretty good box so far. It's only the first box. So I got two more to go. So let's try and speed this up a little bit. Ooh, that's hot. I think we're gonna have three of those. Do I have to return? Yep. Dope. Dope. Nah. Nice. Ricky Fire. Secret, another expansion, another uh, defeating evil. That's the cutest card on the planet. Nope. Those are pretty good for the common zombie wins. And do another card. Just what big boys we need. Alright, get towards the end point. GP8. Ooh, I think it's the first mutant card we got. Virtual World, Mahime. Again, oh, that's right, that's an ultra. What is it? Two ultras that we got? No, because I've got three already. Three already? Four already? I've got four already. Uh, I think that's my last ultra. We still haven't seen a single secret rare. Cry. Ooh, a mutant beast. Nice. Nice. We've got almost the entire deck already. And again, this is only our first box. Rave after a Ooh, we got one of the dual avatar fusions, another mutant crash. Alright, hold on one second. Still no secrets. Uh, I think we already have three mutant cries. You ain't man a match generator. I need one more of those. Ooh. Oh, we got our first secret. I forgot about that. I forgot all about that trap card. Uh, I actually really like warning point. I think that has potential to be a very very annoying trap card. So I'm actually not mad that we pulled one. I would have preferred. Uh, uh, torn scaled, but it's okay. All right. Whoa. Do all the compacts. Bam. All right. I think is it only one secret for box? Or is it two? I think it's two. So we still have one more secret in here somewhere. Another dual avatar. Another mutant beast. Not bad. Uh, we already done mutant fusions. I think we're done with like all the mutant comments now. Next. Conjurer, he may. Word! I wanted Arc Rebellion Dragon very much. That's actually one of the secrets I wanted. So I am very pleased. Uh, this first box was absolutely banging. Alright, let's finish off these last two packs and move on to the next one. Lanius. I don't even know what that is. Rock Band Xeno Guitar. That's a cool name. Alright. Alright. One second. Alright. On to the next one. Alright. We got a lot of good stuff. Hopefully we can keep on getting good pulls. Oh. That's 
til nogen Ultras back to back. Not ones I need, but still good. Again, like I said, other than these three piles, pretty much everything else, well, except for this guy. Everything else is up for grabs, so feel free to hit me up. Alright, ouch. Give me an expansion. Dope! I got three of those. Alright, cool. Oh, we got synthesis. Come on, man. We're almost there. We need one more beast, some more level eights, and at least one more synthesis. Got that. Oh, strange lane, yes. Let's go with the super battle. Alright. Dope. Yo, mutants want me to make the deck, man. We still haven't got um the last one. Wow, I can't think of the name right now. Okay, no? Ah, I don't remember. We'll figure it out. But uh Got two of both the other ones. Doom, doom, doom. Virtual world. The reason I'm not grabbing any more of the um the dual avatar commons or the mutant commons because I already have tri triples of all of them. Out of the first box. Oh my god. Boom, 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 boom. Hyper UA Stadium. I said that wrong. UA Hyper Stadium. Virtual world stuff. Come on, give me a torn scale. There we go. Alright, that's two of those. Arsenal, that's the one I was forgetting. So look at that. Looking good, looking good. Oh, we got one of the one of the uh, dual avatar fusions. Fusion for uh, Dogmatica, right? That's cool. I don't play Dogmatica, but again, anybody wants it, feel free to hit me up. Nice. Yep, if you guys look in the description, you'll also see my Twitter. You can DM me on Twitter. Any of that stuff. Doom, doom, doom. I actually am kind of happy about that. I've been meaning to try this card out in my Phantom Knights because sometimes I get left with extra material on monsters, so I'm actually pretty happy I pulled that. I would only run it at one because I need the setup, but I've definitely been thinking about running that one. It's searchable and it's, uh, it's a counter trap. Nice. I guess uh, the last box was all mutants. This one's all dual avatars. kids so that's two of those what the hell is this oh that's interesting the trap card lets you get another normal summon unfortunately uh you know the trap card if that was a spell card that would actually be almost good oh i'm gassed i forgot about this guy i forgot all about zeus this card is Stupid in almost every single deck. And I am so gassed that I just pulled this. Oh my god. It's just, you could make it off of any XYZ and it's just, uh, just a board nuke. Ugh. It's so disgusting to talk about. Yep. 
Yeah, go on. Right there. I've been meaning to try that in Cyber Dragons. For like, there's way too many times where I have an extra Nova or something like that. Virtual World. Sorry. Right. <laughs> I'm over here rushing. I'm over here rushing. I'm making sure you guys see the card. I'm sorry. I'm just I'm baffled by that. And again, our secrets are at the bottom of the box. Because that's the, I think that's the first secret we saw in this box. And here's our second. Yep. The Virtual World Big Boy. This is the, probably the one secret I, I, I didn't really want, but it's okay. Hopefully, hopefully he's worth something good. Alright, here we go. Virtual. Nice. see I'm pretty happy with my boxes I've got a decent amount of all the stuff that I wanted some stuff that I didn't but we'll talk about that after I'm actually gonna put you up here now all right let's see what we get <gasps> I wanted that all right guys unfortunately like I said that's where the video cuts off but I will post up everything that I pulled that is super or higher that I'm willing to get rid of right now Here's the supers. Here's the ultras and secrets. Uh, if you guys want to see what I pulled for the other archetypes, I actually pulled um, the mutant secret, another mutant ultra, and another uh, dual, a dual avatar fusion. So I have a playset of one of the fusions. Um, I pulled a, after the Raiders Knight was the biggest thing for me in that last box as far as Phantom Knights. I unfortunately didn't get to see a torn scale. But I do, that is all I need for the deck. So, all in all, uh, the box were actually pretty fun to open. I pulled a lot of great stuff. I have, uh, like, cores for, like, every deck in the, in the set. Uh, hit me up if you guys are interested. And I will catch you on the next video. Later.